Hey guys, this is Drew Mario 1306. Welcome back to my let's play of Crash Bandicoot Warped. Last time we finished off the rest of the sixth warp room, or yeah, our sixth time trial at, at area. We collected everything there, and in this part, let's see. I think we got everything except for. Well, what we're going to do in this part is get all the colored gem routes. Which, after you get a colored gem from the death route, there's actually a second route hidden in the level. Yeah, there's a second route in the level. And you get a gem if you get through that level. And the gem's just clear, so there's no special colored gem or anything. I will say though that, like I said, the, the special routes are harder than the original routes. Well, what was the point of that? Sorry if I'm not talking talking much. I should be talking more about stuff. All right, we start with the red gem wrapped here in level four, the boneyard. And you're gonna get chased by that dinosaur that just chased us. There's a checkpoint. No boxes in the level. Yeah. They feature things from uh, Dynamite, which is the other uh, dinosaur level. Whoa. As you notice that I'm running, I don't know if running actually helps because I think the, s the dinosaur runs faster if you run. Because from the looks of it, I'm, it doesn't look like I'm getting away from him. And I'm almost jumping into the lava. There's a lot of pterodactyls in the area. Whoa! Okay. Yeah, that was the risk right there. And yeah, you do need to double jump in some areas. And the pterodactyl's gonna take me back to the checkpoint. But why did it take a one-up from me? I don't know why. I'll admit, this this is... This is a hard, uh... gem route. Yeah. And I jumped into the... hot smoke. All the I haven't really thought about which one of the, uh, the the special gem routes is the hardest. Come to think of it, it's either this one. What? Well, at least I didn't I didn't jump over it like I did the last two times. Is it, like, impossible to get through that area? It's either this route or the blue gem route, I think. I think the yellow one is easy, and so is the green one, but the others might be more difficult. Okay, I got through there, no problem. 
out of those three, the two, the one in the middle, is always... It never uh, flames up. Finally, I got the uh, gem. That was one of the more difficult ones. It took me five minutes already. Of course, there's the one minute intro, but still. Yeah, that's one of the more difficult gem routes. Yeah, the red one. Uh, is there any here? Uh, oh yeah, Tomb Time. This is where the purple gem route is. I think this one is, I think, third hardest or easiest, because it's only... Actually, there's six of them, but... Yeah, there's six of them. There's all the colored gem routes, and they, there's actually a route where they have all in one, where there's like a blue gem route that leads to a green gem route, and then you'll find a green gem platform. From there, you will find the purple gem platform, I think, and then it's and then it's yellow and red. After that, that that area, that uh, that route, you need all five gems. Otherwise, you can't get through that special route. And we haven't got all the boxes the first time. Like I said, the rest of the boxes are in the yellow gem route. Okay, I don't know why they blew, blew up. They didn't hit zero, but probably because it was out of the picture, that's why, that's why it blew up. Alright, I think that's what you were supposed to do, and then jump up here if you had the uh, single jump, or, oh yeah, ducking and jumping, that's, that's another way. That was, my, that was the only way I was supposed to get through that Future Frenzy special route. Should be cutting it out, but I think we're almost to the uh, yellow gem round. Or not yellow gem, purple gem. Yeah, we're very close. It's just behind those trap doors. Don't get flattened. Alright, right here. That there's the purple gem round. Yes, it was released. Uh what I would do in order to get all the boxes, I think it's possible to do it both ways. But what I would do is go this way, I think. Well, I don't know. All the times I've tried it, I went through the gem route and then doubled back the other way. Uh, yeah, that, that's what I'll do in this this area. Whoa. I think it's the only it's the only way to get all the boxes because there's no platform that on the at the end of the uh, the platform is deactivated at the end of this route so you gotta like activate it in order to to, the, to go backwards through this route and yeah be careful right here. There is a lot of oil here, so, or actually tar, 
slippery tar, so be careful. Be very careful with this one. And there's the gem. Actually, could you double back on this one? I think you can. I'll try doubling back on this one first. Whoa. Yeah, it's definitely possible to double back on this one. You just have to be careful of the obstacles. And I should have hit that switch. Oh yeah, I was going to show you how to double back on the other way, so... What am I doing wasting my time? I'm already 11 minutes in. And I plan to show you... Well... I guess I can show you another part for the rest of the gem routes. I almost got flattened there. I think a double jump is possible. Be aware, if you get the checkpoint in this game, whatever boxes that are not... Oh, fudge! I almost hit that. Whatever... Anyway, whatever boxes that are not opened won't be saved to the checkpoint. It will only take you to here. And then you gotta like double jump and then do a death tornado spin. Um, this one, you just gotta death tornado it all the way. Jump and then death tornado spin all the way. That's how I doubled back this way. And there's the checkpoint. Alright. Let's get those last two crates near the end of the level. Which is right here. I think the only way... If you don't see those wooden or those tall bricks, just duck and jump. It's the only means of getting those boxes, and we got all 95 of them. So that should give us another gem. So we got both of the gems in this level. There's the gem for getting all the boxes, and there is the clear gem for going through the purple gem route. That's only two uh, gems, though. Let's see. Got... Yep, just making sure we got everything here. Yeah, we got everything here. Except for level 11, Dynamite. We still have to get the yellow gem routes, so... The gem in the yellow gem routes. And of course all 112 of the boxes. First, I'll meet you at the yellow gem route. Okay, I didn't expect to get invincibility there, but okay, we did. So now... We are in the third. Of these colored gem routes, the yellow gem route.
Yeah, there are 30 boxes here in the yellow gem box. This gives you lump of fruit. This part is the easy part. Well, at least it's not as hard as the, uh, it's not as hard as the, the red gem round, where all you, are you, all you're doing is just getting chased by that monster, that dinosaur. Of course, those are steel crates, so they're they're invincible to anything except for a body slam. Here's a checkpoint. I think this chase is easier than the other one, even though we're in the harder of the two levels. This uh, this chase is easier than the previous one because because you're used to these obstacles. Oh fudge! Maybe not. Maybe not. Geez, I almost got hit there. Okay, and this is the nitro deactivation crate. So yeah. Now, if you jump over this yellow platform, jet platform, go over this wall, five one-ups. You're probably thinking, can you get over those walls? No. I think there is as many as, I don't know, seven or eight of those crates. So yeah, going through the first set of steel crates, you get five one-ups, but there's no way you can get past the second set of crates. And that's about it for this death route, or special gem route. Or is it? Then you probably have to double back. Be very careful though, as there'll be obstacles in this area. Especially those guys in the water. Those are the ones, those are the enemies that you should be worried about. Right about, well not now, but now, right there. Be very careful with those enemies. And there's another one. He didn't go after me, but I almost got hit. There's our baby dinosaur, Agathos Rex. Later on, I'll show his level. Well, this is where we would have picked him up. Whoa! Come back! Oh, he's right over there. Okay. He respawned right up there. And this is where... we went through the yellow gem round. Alright. I guess I'll meet you at the end of the level now. There's the gym. We're getting all the boxes in this level. And of course I got the other gem, like I said. Uh, I'm going to save the rest of the de uh, special gem routes for later, for the next part. So that's what we're going to do next time. Thanks for watching. This has been Drew Mario 1306, and I'll see you in the next part for the rest of the color gem routes.